This is the story of the Crimean War's bizarre plan, the plan to use massive steam-powered tractors as war machines. The year is 1855, the British and French are bogged down in the siege of Sevastopol. The campaign is an absolute logistical nightmare. The roads are miles of thick, freezing, impassable mud. Supplies, ammunition, and food cannot reach the front lines quickly enough. Thousands of horses and mules are dying daily from exhaustion and disease. The British command realized they needed a revolutionary solution. They looked to the growing power of the industrial age. The idea was simple, replace animal labor with steam power. They ordered the deployment of massive steam traction engines. These were the powerful self-propelled tractors of the era. Some forward-thinking engineers had an even more bizarre idea. They proposed armoring these rolling boilers with heavy iron plates. They envisioned a protected, mobile war machine to clear the battlefield. The primary mission, however, was transportation. The steam tractors arrived in the Crimea to a mixed reception. Their sheer hauling power was undeniable. They could haul up to 50 tons of supplies at a time. This was a massive advantage over conventional animal transport. But the reality of the Russian battlefield was harsh. The machines were incredibly slow and often broke down. They required massive amounts of coal and water to operate continuously. They were also huge, loud, and highly vulnerable to enemy artillery fire. The concept of the steam-powered war machine proved impractical for 1855. The army was not yet ready for fully mechanized warfare. The plan failed to solve the immediate crisis entirely. But the bizarre experiment did not fade from military memory. The core principle was established and documented. The idea of an armored, self-propelled track-laying vehicle was planted. The Crimean War's failed steam machine directly foreshadowed a key invention. It was the blueprint for the tanks that would appear 60 years later in World War I. The bizarre plan proved to be one of history's great military concepts far ahead of its time.